You know how we love to get presents and rip off that wrapping paper like we're five years old? But have you ever thought about how much garbage we create in the process? Well, I'll tell you, about four million tons every holiday season in the US and half a million here in Canada. That is crazy. But today, I got a solution with a very special guest who's gonna show us how to upcycle, recycle, and sparkle up our wrapping. Today is the day. Let's make this happen. Thank you for joining me in the kitchen, Tiffany. It's my pleasure. I'm so excited to be here. <laughs> it is so awesome to have Tiffany Pratt, the director of All Things Beautiful in Everyone's World, Thank here you. to help us reduce our waste when we're giving gifts. Yay! All right, so let's get crafting. Let's do it. Okay, what are we making? We're taking your everyday jar. So mason jars are easy to find at any hardware store, especially during jar and canning season. What we're gonna start with okay. is taking your lid and you wanna just make sure that the string will go around your lid. So just do like a little test fit of okay. the string to go around your lid. So Megan, you can take your little scrap and see how long your fabrics are cut sort of horizontally in a rectangle. Yes. Just stick it in the center of your string like I've done with my yarn. And tie a knot. Tie a knot. Okay. And then you do it again. So I've actually also cut up bubble wrap, and bubble wrap can lay on the pile. So once, did you tie it? Are you good? Take a little pile like this, Yeah. lay it through the center, tie another knot. And bubble wrap is actually beautiful. I love the way it looks. It adds a little bit of shine to something, and yeah. it adds a little puff to the pom-pom. Next, you can take your faux flowers, and again, Maybe. are you really doing no, that? No, okay, once you... <laughs> You're gonna ruin the fluffiness. It's not gonna right, be as okay. like, fluffy fabulous. Okay, so then I'm adding, like see a little faux flower, add it in the center of the pile, tie another knot. I have, I, I have these on my bicycle. Yeah, you, know. you do. Just pillage them off your bike. Reduce, reuse, recycle, close the loop. Okay. Right. <laughs> close the loop. Close the loop. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. Is this not cute? This is, I, I thought that this was like really difficult. I thought you actually had special powers, but it turns out that special powers I do have, but I'm sharing them with you. That's okay. why I'm here. So we've got our little pom-poms. Look at these yeah. things. Aren't Ooh. they adorable? Oh my goodness. Let's start stuffing a drawer, shall we? Yes. Okay, so what do you want to stuff first? I want to stuff my stuff. Tell Wait, me, well, stuff my stuff. Before you hit your stuff, we have to put a little like soft landing oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. for your stuff. So what did you want to add? I'm gonna, I like this shredded scrap paper stuff. It's pretty magical. Yeah, I kind of just like this. I like this stuff here. Put it in. Ooh, this is all good. The fun part about doing this is there's no rhyme to reason. It's not like there are rules. It's just find yeah. a bunch of recyclable, cool, upcyclable things that you can yeah. throw in a jar. You don't want to put too much at the bottom because you want to have a little bit of space to put your items. So put your little nut sack in Ooh, there. Can I just yeah, or do I, do I put that. that at the end? Yep. I just want a little sparkle in there. I'm going to add my own stuff. Of Easter now. grass, whatever that is. Well, some people use Easter grass. Can I start stuffing some of this stuff? Yeah, go for it. I'm going to use Megan's Body Love Butter. Ooh. I'm also going to use Megan's little sleep mask. Yeah, you take the sleep mask. I'm putting the tote bag in. I'm going to roll it. I'm going to give the one in the package. I would actually want this jar. If you want to give me the sleep mask and the body butter, I won't say no. It could, it could happen. It okay, could happen. so. Once everything's in there, you kind of have a little bit of space around the objects inside, which I want to throw Dazzle in. So yeah. feathers are great. Okay. More of the, if you want to add more of the, the paper shred that you put in initially, great. But I think feathers are fun because when you pull it out, you know what, my nieces like and party. nephews are going to love this. They're going to be like, oh, now you're our favorite auntie. <laughs> Basically, it's a jar pinata. <laughs> I love that, except we're not going to smash these, right? No, no smashing. That's yeah. bad with glass. Okay. Pop your, pop your lid on. Got my lid. Scrap fabric is around everyone's house. Yes. You don't have any around your house. Oh my God. Like we were cut from the same cloth. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. So any scrap fabric is fabulous. Yep. You can actually layer. So if you want to get two different types and just yep. layer them in opposite patterns. Love these. Whatever you think is the easiest. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna use rubber bands. Rubber bands to fasten the fabric to the top. Everyone's okay. seen this before, but layering it is all kinds of fun and fabulous. Okay. Rainbow string. Yes. So I'm going to give you, so you've got some rainbow string. I've got some rainbow Actually, string. Actually, why don't you use the beads? Yeah, I'll use Here. the beads. Where's that string? Yes. So wrap it around. Yep. I'm going to wrap around my string, sort of as shown. Dun, da, da, da. Is it working? Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's working. totally working. That doesn't that look like a, like that's insane. And so I'm going to get a necklace a out of the deal. 
party in a jar. Collector's item, Megan made necklace, FYI. <laughs> and then you just add your pom-pom and you're done. The only last piece that I think is super fun and all kinds of wonderful is putting something like a tag on it that's from nature. So can you talk about this little piece? Wait, of... I need to tie my pom-pom on. Oh, you're doing that, okay. Oh yeah, so we've got tags that come from birch. Yeah! So these are awesome because you can write people's names on them. You put a little hole punch through it. You can actually just use the scissors and cut a little hole. Or you use the scissors and cut a little hole. Cut a little hole. Cut a little hole. Do you want some help? Oh, yeah, you, you got it. I got it. Lady did it. Can Someone's got a fashion degree. I know how to use scissors. Well, putting it to use the once in a while. <laughs> You're like, I okay, so we're going to... Am I tying the pom-pom on with the beads? You can just loop it through the edge of the beads, whatever's easiest. This seems... Ooh, I'm going to do this, and then we'll leave some tails here to go with the bead tail. So I'm actually taking the pom-pom tail, and I'm putting the little piece of birch through it like so. Yeah, that would and have been smart. And then I'm just going to stick a little, this extra piece of string yeah. through the side where I wrap the yarn. Okay. And I'm just going to tie a knot. I'm tying a knot here. Yeah. Tie a knot wherever you want. There's no rules in crafting. Anyone that tells you there's only one way to do it is a liar. Yeah. This is the fun part about crafting is it can be oh your way God. and fabulous. My way is fabulous. Your way is so fabulous. Is Look awesome. at these jar parties. <laughs> Charlotte. That was so fun. Right? Thank you, Tiffany, for bringing even more sparkle and color into the kitchen with this upcycled gift wrapping. Yay. Fun! Yay! We need to have another crafting play date. Real I soon. would totally love that. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yay. So here's the deal. Tiff and I want to give you at home these beautiful presents Yay. using our reusing upcycled creative jars. Here's life. what you're going to do. Post your pics to Instagram of your best upcycling adventures, tagging me at Megan Telbner using hashtag MeganTV, and we will give you, select one lucky, actually two lucky winners, our jar of love. Yay! Follow us on Twitter. We love to hear from you. Thank you, Tiffany. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Yay!